Hello and welcome back to the Eddian Project. We really, really appreciate you joining us and thanks for the uh, quite a few trickle of subscribers. Oh, yeah, no Fantastic. It must be because Ed does this, no, I don't this, think this so. smash thing and boot it and kick it and strangle I, it. I think, I think it's because uh, I'm telling you at the studio and they're, they're intrigued to know what you're doing. Yeah, I don't know, yeah. yeah. Down there meat, cooking up a nice meal or something like Reading that, you know? manuals oh, about, yeah, about the SSLs. Or doing a bit of gardening. Yeah. Or, you know. Today we're going to be reviewing the... The UC one, which is the universal controller one that, that goes alongside the UF one. Let's get to it, Ed. Yes. Right then, Ed. So this... Can't remember what it's called now. The UC1. The UC1. And this is, this, is, this is the unit I bought first. Right. And I'm going to have to tell the guys I bought the rest the day after. <laughs> right. Because I was that impressed with it. It's just an impressive. It, well, it's incredible. Right. It's incredible. Okay. To get. Now then. As, as the guys can see, right, we've got the selected channels, the roll and drums. Yeah. Now, this is what I love about it. This is what first impressed me. You press a channel and it goes directly to it. Yeah. To it. Now, you'd probably think, well, why is that a, a, a thing? But, right, not only can you change <coughs> the going up, you know, the, the channel selection here, but you can also make it change from Cubase. Now, from this Cubase. doesn't happen with anything else. No, right. And this is what... I, I think if I had, a, if I had a, a little bit of a dispute with with the, the UF-8, it would be that it doesn't that, do, it do that. So basically what this can do is, if, whatever you, if you change the channel on Cubase, it will reflect into this hardware SSL, mm -hmm. UC1. That's right. If you change the channel on the UC1, SSL UC1, that will reflect in Cubase. It does. So whatever you're doing, either of them either reflects way. on the other. It's like... Marvellous. But it's... unfortunately, you know, the UF8 doesn't do that. So, you know, Hopefully, there'll be a, an update. Be an update. But oh, it's been out a while, though, so yeah. it's, it's, it's... But yeah. let's face it, you don't need the UFA to do it, because why would you want to do it on the UFA and then move on to the UC1 to do the functions? No, well, you know... You wouldn't. Yeah. So just change it on the UC1 while you're still there, then the functions are all then there the for functions, you. the that's, yeah. functions, that's, I think they've thought it out pretty well. Yeah. Anyway. Gonna, anyway. What we're going to do now Ed, is is show the guys. Again, we're going to use your your uh, latest track, and uh, we're going to show the functions here. Let's uh, let's solo that out. And let's go on to the. Um, the Roland kit, I think. Are we going to run out of Roland kit? We are. Yeah. 80s kit, there you go. Select the 80s kit. Yeah. So, select on there. Now, as you can see, it's gone to the, the 80s it's kit. It's kit on and, channel 3, um, yeah. And we can't hear anything. Ah, it's because 80s kit is... I don't think come in, I don't think, till the chorus, no, that's does that's right, it? yeah. Here we are. So, this is now going through a simulation of the SSL yeah. uh, desk on one channel. Yeah. And as you can hear, yeah. look at that. You bring up the, 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 the high gain yeah. and you can hear it happening. Yeah. yeah, that's what I said in one of the previous e episodes. This is what I love about things like this. A lot of people go, oh, keep it in the door. Yeah, but having the hardware there that controls what you've got in the door, you're then relying on what should be as, a, as an right. engineer, your ears. That's right. And you, you've got an knob there to turn and use your ears to listen rather than pointing with a mouse and watching. That's right. And, you know. And look, it's it's like it's like the good old days. Well, that's yeah. You know, look at this. Yeah. yeah. I mean, obviously it's too much. Oh yeah. You'd... But and you've got the frequency, you've got the gain, you've got the cue control. Yeah. That's it. All pretty self-explanatory. Yeah. Oh, now yeah. then. Yeah. This button here, Ed, brings in the E series. Yeah. So if you're on the G. 
G console, you can switch between That's the G right. and the E to see what you get. Uh, marvellous. Yeah. Yeah. It's marvellous. The only thing you can't do that with is the 4K. If you've got the 4K module loaded, that's disabled. That's disabled, right. So, in, in fact, what you've actually got is a choice between SSL's three consoles. Right. Which you can mix, mix and match. Mix and match, yeah. So, if you go into... Let's go into 360 here a minute. Can you see, Ed? Uh, we've see, got, yeah. Now, we've got... The black one is the 4000 series, yeah. right? Yeah. Um... And then you see, sometimes we, I, I haven't got the E-series yeah. on the, um, which is the, like a, a VST scape. It's like yeah. a soundscape um, yeah. sound that we've got there. Yeah. And I've chose to have it on the, uh, the G-series. Yeah. This is the G-series, isn't it? Well, the, the dark one is a G, G-series. All right. So, if it's not the E-series, then it's something other series, isn't it? Well... I mean, this is the thing, I'm not 100% sure, because I don't know, but from what I know, because I've got wave, I've got the Waves version at home, mm. which is a similar thing, and it only comes as a, uh, it comes as the, the Waves SSL um, channel strip, mm. and it tells you, it doesn't say anything what it is, but when you read on the, 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 the site, and for one, it's based on the 4000 series, mm. and it says you can have it in two modes. You can have the DAT mode, which is the old older G console, or you can have the later That's modes, fine. which is the E console. Mm. And if there's a third mode in there, that must be the later one, the 9000 console. 9000 console. Well, that, you see, can you see, Ed, we've got on here, I right, can see on the that. EQ, there's no option there. And the it's G, just, yeah. you either turn it on, on or, or off. off. Yeah. But on these, you've yeah. got the E, or whatever not E is. Right, it's, it's switchable. So it must be between. The very latest console it might be the, and the E series. It might be the E and the 9000, that could yeah, be that, yeah. that's right. I uh, think so, yeah. yeah. So, we've got, on this, actually, we've got a we've got a mixture, then, of the classic console and the other, and... The newer console. The newer console yeah. and the one in between. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, it's like, um, you know, it's like having your cake and eating it. Well, it's just different flavours, isn't different it? Different flavours, yeah, yeah. Um, now then, going back to the, um, going back to the, uh, the, let's go to the synth base here just to show the guys how this works. Now this is absolutely marvellous. Now, as you can see, look, as we're moving the channel strip, it's not only just happening in, um, the ch channel selector, it's not just happening here, it'll right? Happen it'll well. happen in Cubase as well, yeah. right? Mm -hmm. So, there you go, you can go up and down like that, yeah. right? And then you can... Uh, obviously, you've got the um, the uh, what are these uh, 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 low low pass and high pass uh, yeah, low filters, pass and, high pass filters yeah. um, and then you've got uh, the EQ section, and then you've got the the uh, the low watts it's there. Um, yeah, well, I see your your low frequency has got a gain and a frequency select, right. but you've also got a little a little uh, switch for putting them in bell mode. That's it. Yeah, which is. Uh, yeah. yeah, it is marvellous. It is marvellous. And then obviously you've got then the uh, a built-in compressor on each yeah, channel. Yeah, which is great, yeah. Um, and then you've got uh, an expander yeah. or uh, noise gate, yeah, I believe. Yeah, you've got a whole dynamics side there. I'll turn it into an expander by pressing yeah. that button there. That's right. So it's a gate or an expander, yeah. And I think this is a... Um, That's a phase. Phase switch, what, yeah. Six, yeah. And then you can have a listen yeah, to what's going through your side and chain, a solo, a solo, solo cut, and, and whatever. Yeah. yeah. So and the channel in the row, and again, this fine. You've got button, this fine button. You press that and hold it down, and it's fine control. And, and it's fine yeah. control. So yeah. I mean, look at that. Yeah. I don't know if. I, I, hopefully, I'm not getting in the way here. Um, oh, you can I can see, see that. Yeah. Now, if you if you yeah, if you turn, turn it off, turn it a lot. But yeah, look at that. That's right. The slightest little turn. Slightly, sli yeah. That's so it. there's a lot more. Um, there's a lot, lot more controllability with the fan. Absolutely. Yeah. 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 You can really. This this here is amazing, isn't it? It, it is amazing, Ed. Yeah. This here, right, is for the bus control on the um, on the master bus. Yeah. Now, if we go into Cubase and then uh, bring up the. Uh, the, the what's it? Right, we'll go along here. It's just marvellous. And you select 
the, um, where are we, the SSL meter. Now that's, this will bring up... Um, oh yeah, that's your ballistic view. That's you know, right, yeah. And your scope and everything. That's which right, is which, is, which we've already... Well, we, we touched on that in We the, touched on that in the... I think on the, the first SSL we did. That's right, yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, now then, where is the... Uh, There you go. Now, this um, this this pertains to this. This is on the master bus. Yes, yeah. You can see it. When I that's oh, marvelous. Look at that. I know. And the makeup and uh, everything there. I mean, it's it's yeah. it's just. Can, yeah. Um, well, it's just like the one that's about one of the, the, it there's is. no desk. It even looks like it, it does. Of course, it? it does. Even color coded with mm -hmm. it. Can Can you let the guys see I me? Mean, if you're on about the track, then you can actually mess around here. You can see the. You can, Absolutely. You can see yes, the, yeah. We can see the needle movement, and um, then you can. We can see, yeah. I mean, there you go. So if you change, it's a bit hot at the moment. Well, but you, so I mean, I suppose if you change the threshold, we try the threshold again. Yeah. We we'll come back. You can see them come more. Yeah. But and see, you can see. It's yeah. With, yeah. It's on the, on the desk as well. And if we just really whack them down. Well, so if we maybe wanted them just a couple of dB. I think we're as low as we can go on that. Yeah. Yeah. But you know. Maybe the signal running there is a little bit hot. A little bit hot at the moment. So yeah. it leaves you less control. But you can see that you, we've got you know, about 3 to 4 dB of compression, but we can actually boost them right up. We like, can, yeah. You know, and you can, see it, you can see and you can it see reflected. It on the, and the hardware meter as well. Uh, yeah. And it's, it's so responsive. Both of them are, are immediate to what you do. Absolutely, yeah. Um, and of course, you've got your ratio, the attack, your release times, makeup gain. Um, you get your in and out, you hear the differences on it, you can have a, a mix on it, which really mix or, you know, the wet and dry. I don't, yeah. I've never understood that why you have a mix on a compressor, because you're really going to have to do it or not. You don't want a mix of the, the dry signal and That's the right. Well, but you know, yeah, the, you never know. A lot of people do like well, to, I know. to parallel. Pa parallel well, processing, don't yeah, but they? You, but would do, you would do that before you hit the master bus. On the master bus, it's normally just your compression, mm. isn't it? Anyway, so... But so it's, it's just, That really does impress me, that. It does, because, yeah. You know. I mean, you've got oversampling here. Oh, and you've got I've got a good system, so we can whack it up to four times four, oversampling. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah. Um, and then, I think this plug-in mixer, what does... Yeah, that just brings up the, uh, yeah. the, the 360. And, of course, yeah. as people know, that SSL... Master bus compressor is what's known as the glue compressor. The glue, yeah. And it's fuck, it, it, it does. It is, it is the glue it does. compressor, yeah. Right. How about this then, Ed? Ooh. Right, let's go Excuse to me. um let's go to uh your um guitars. Right? Mm -hmm. And we'll select we'll select that. Now we've got um the guitar channels here selected. Sixteen. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Now this is fantastic as well, yeah. love it. You've got presets, Ed. Yeah, you press a preset. Right. Now then, let's say, for instance, that we've got two guitars on there that, that we want the same treatment to. Yeah. All we're going to do now is come down to the, the channel strip, Yeah. press down... And scroll with presets, is it? And then you've got all these presets down here, Ed, right? Yeah, I see that, yeah. Um, and I'll, it, we've got... Different categories. You've got yeah. um, producer presets, yeah. um, and you can see when I'm pressing, selecting the preset, right? Yeah, it's, it's coming up. Yeah. It's reflecting in the settings on here of as course. well, and of course on the screen yeah, there. Course, yeah. You can see, you can see that happening. Oh, you should yeah. be able to. Where are we? Um, yeah, there we go. It's, yeah. it's to the right of the screen, guys. Should, the yeah. last channel on the screen there. Yeah, um, and you can see. But this is. This is um, uh, how you, how it operates on here. Now I really love this because let's say, for instance, that uh, we've selected a guitar sound. Mm -hmm. You've gone and done another guitar, right, to mirror it so we can pan it left and right. Yeah. Now all we're going to do now is go to track seventeen, mm -hmm. and let's say that is your other guitar. Yeah. Now notice how the preset channel strip has stayed the same. Yeah, yeah. So now to apply it. All we've got to do is press, press that. So both channels. So got, both channels now I've got exactly are identical. The, uh, are treated exactly the same. Marvellous. Uh, how, how quick is that? It's marvellous, yeah. 
Yeah. It is. And it's uh, absolutely incredible. Uh, yeah. I love it. Yeah. Well, it's not incredible, but it's, it's, it's just a lovely way to work. Oh, yeah. Um, very, very convenient. It is very convenient. Now, um, the last thing, Ed, is um, we've just gone through the preset, obviously. Mm -hmm. But then you've got the input trim. Yeah. And the and output, the output trim. trim. Yeah. So, um, and that is basically um, how much gain you want on the input. Yeah. And, how much, how much and that's before it hits the SSL, SSL desk. SSL desk, yeah. You know, the, the master fader. And of course, what I notice also here, um, that's, that's great, you've got, you've got um, a confirm button for obviously whatever you're doing so you can confirm mm -hmm. the function. And as you see, you get the, the presets here, mm -hmm. but you've got a routing. Routing as well. So that's great. Now if you press that and then you can get all your routing there. So you can go, um, you, you can select um, well, you what just, order these go in. That's right. Yeah, it's gone flat and then EQ and delay. That's and it. And you can have it, oh, well, look, yeah, yeah. the preset. Dynamics. It's, 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 it's dynamic, uh, yeah, yeah. yeah. Oh, and now they've moved the EQ that's forward. That's yeah. it, yeah. So it's, it's, it's great. Yeah. I'm um, not sure. I, I'm not sure if the SSL desk does that. I mean, perhaps it does. I don't. I don't know. I've got, I, yeah, digitally, uh, how I would mean, it do that? No, I don't know. But you know, I, I, I'm, I meant analog. How would it do I that? I'm yeah, not sure. I know, but, uh, I know. but but there you go. It's there. Mm. Um, yeah, and that's parallel. You've got EQ there. Yeah, uh, and then uh, FLT well, and the uh, dynamics. I, I think that may be filter. Filter, yeah. And then yeah. EQ and then dynamics. That's right. Yeah. I've got to be honest, Ed. You're impressed, aren't you? I'm impressed, but I, I'm do I, I doubt if I'll use oh, that. Oh, no, but it's there, for, it's there for people that want to use that's that. That's right. Because everybody's got their own workflow. I have, yeah. Um, but I suppose you press the confirm again, does that take, that doesn't take you out of it. We just have to go somewhere else, don't we? Mm -hmm. Oh, you go back to the presets. Yeah. So then we go, and as you've said, and then at the bottom of this right hand, you have your phase control, your... Yeah, well, through all that, your solo clear, your solo cut and fine. So, yeah, I mean, it's it's very comprehensive. It is. Very comprehensive. It is. It. And of, when you link all this together, mm. you have an incredible hardware base. You have. Of, you have. And there was a, the interesting um, uh, study on I saw the other day, how um, I think it was between eight and ten SSL consoles yeah. were examined... I mean, I'm talking about the, the um, analog console. Yeah. And they also, um, with this setup, yeah, they, they, just, they, they, they were comparing them. Yeah. And it actually fell within the boundaries of the rest of the analog hardware. Yeah. Very impressive yeah. study. Yeah. Very I impressive mean, study. SSL have done work. I mean, let's face it, you're talking about a product like SSL, all their deaths have been incredible. Mm. There's no way they're going to release anything no. that isn't incredible. That's right. And it's up to the quality of what the... You know, so that's, that's SSL, you know. It is indeed. And on that, we'll, uh, we'll, we'll the, sign off. We'll sign off, yeah. Well, it's lovely stuff, isn't it, Ed? Well, yeah, I mean, it's exactly the same... Well, although it's different functionality, but it's exactly the same as the UF one regarding the build quality, the design, the features and everything it brings. Which one we're doing next week, Ed? The, well, we'll, the next one we'll be doing is the last in the series, which is the UF8. Bloody marvellous. Ed, it's marvellous. do your... Oh, um... yeah, well, they, they keep, well, actually, I, I, I went to bed last night. You went to bed last night. And just before I did, I had a quick look at the channel, mm. and we were 41 subscribers. When I got mm. this one, there's 42. Mm. So we've picked up a subscriber overnight. We have, yeah. And 120 odd views overnight. Don't forget, this was a few weeks ago, chaps, because we do record quite we do, well yeah, in advance. Yeah, we're all in front, yeah. yeah. I'm going to tell you how it was for us last night, mm. not for them guys. But, yeah, but hopefully this is what's happening. These guys are biting, smashing... Kicking, slapping, head button, strangling, scr scratching, drowning, burning. The, um, they are. The, the, they the, are. Yeah, the subscribe button. Yeah. And, and, and all you have got to do, actually, so well, one, little, one little finger, press. One little finger, yeah. If you like what we're putting up, guys, in the, the content and everything, like that, give us a thumbs up and the likes. Yeah. Also, don't forget to smash that notification bell. Yeah. And, um, you know, you'll be updated with content we put up. And there'll be a fiver in the post for the guys that have subscribed. Yeah, from Ian's pocket, yeah, not for, not for Mickey. From He's Mr. Yeah. Carnegie, know, you know. Yeah. Um, and also, we like to talk, guys. We do. We do like So please, down 
give us in the comments. Down there, Let's yeah. get a bit of a banter going on. Mm. Let us know what your likes are, what your dislikes are, and dislikes, exactly, yeah. and what you think of the products yourself, etc. Yeah. See you next week, boys. See you next week.